So belantamab is a, um, uh, actually a therapy that um, we are widely using right now. So we have data from the DREAM2 trial. Um, and now we have a lot of um, retrospective trials that um, evaluate the real life data with this uh, medication. So we recently published our experience from Mayo with uh, 36 patients treated with belantamab. Uh, six of them received it in combinations, so either with pomalidomide, thalidomide, or cytoxin. Um, and uh, actually, in terms of efficacy, we had similar results to the DREAM trial, so around 30-32% of overall response rates. And in terms of safety, um, actually this therapy was safe, so only 30% uh, of the patients were hospitalized um, due to infections. And um, in terms of ocular toxicity, which is more interesting, we had a grade three ocular toxicity of around 40%, uh, which is much less than the DREAM2 trial. Um, and I think now uh, trials are evaluating the uh, how we should use it actually and how should we give it because we are giving it actually according to the protocol every three weeks uh, but currently the trials that, the trials that were presented here are starting to give it every four weeks every eight weeks and probably this will change the ocular toxicity so we need to better understand how to manage this ocular toxicity